Good morning YouTube. Welcome back to another video in this beautiful morning in France. It's currently uh, like 10 minutes to 10. That says 15 degrees. That's inside the house. <laughs> but nonetheless the weather is good today. As you can see, I think like 11, 12 degrees midday. So it's a beautiful day. Nonetheless. Today just chill right after yesterday's race um, if you're interested in the numbers of yesterday's race skip to this number then you'll find I'm breaking down the race and talking about the race but other than that join me today we're heading that direction all the way to Lyon it's the biggest city around this er area that's where I landed when I came to France so, let's get to Leon. Taking into consideration uh, how hard yesterday was, not feeling too bad, eh? Not feeling too bad. So, on my way to Lyon, about 55 k's left, probably, then I'm there. There's this nice park that I saw on Google, who are checking that out, and then looking for a bakery. So, yeah, let's continue to enjoy this beautiful day. And another great opportunity to pedal a bicycle. for some down hills So we made it to Lyon. Now on my way to a park. Gonna scope the park out and then action for boulangerie. Take me to your heart. I belong, I belong to you. Just crossing some random ass bridge on my way to the park. This place is gorgeous. I guess this is the park. I assume I have arrived. Bakery spotted. Paul Boulangerie. Oh yeah. So this stop is well worth it. Some chicken and grain sandwich and a pan of chocolate. Chilling in the city and then I'll make my way back. I'm about 80 k's from home, but yeah, 
It's not too bad to change the roads up for a bit. The coffee went down amazingly back there. Now I've got about 80 k's to get back home. For now I'm enjoying the city life and back to my little town. Let's go. So that wall is 100% painted. All of it. Got about 70 k's and I'm home. So I'm gonna smash this last two and a half hours and then I'll chat to you guys once I'm at home. And just like that, back home. 160 k's, five hours and 20 minutes. Very good ride. I really enjoyed this. Now, time to talk about yesterday's race. First, the first thing that happened is we got a key cast team photo. Then we had a super nervous neutral. Super nervous, eventually stopped, got to kilometer zero, and then boom, let's go. My positioning was good. I was happy with where I was positioned the whole race, but it was bloody hard. Like I think I followed too many moves. Now that I know I was a bit too active, now I know. So, but that's how you learn from races. You take a race for race. So first of all, we started over here in Moulins. I don't know how to pronounce that, so I'm not even going to try and correct myself. But we started in town, so that was our neutral section all the way. I think until like round about here somewhere. And then we got stopped and we smashed it all the way. We just absolutely smashed it. There we did a lap I don't even know of. But that was the finishing lap. We absolutely hit it. Then went out, did this massive lap. I remember this lap. And then we came back and we did like a 4K circuit at the finish over here. Which I thought would be relatively like Belgium critty. Yes it was, but the road was even smaller. It was like a meter and a half wide terrible conditions and I think we did four or five laps I can't 100% remember I just remember looking at the board on the side but it was crazy and you took that left turn over there and then it was like 500 meters to the finish right there going into the last lap Toma my teammate came up moved me up perfectly around about till yeah I was on the perfect wheel kept it around that corner not too bad and then out of that corner when i try to kick or like start a sprint of some sort i just sat back down as you can see let me zoom in then i'll show you there's the laps when i try to kick take boom 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 it was like 500 watts no 700 i at least peaked at 700 but i just sat back down it was crazy it was super crazy. My max watts for the day was 1,500. But I got that here in the beginning somewhere. Because I assume it's following a move or something. I've got no idea what it's from. But yeah, it was crazy. The numbers for the race, it was 173 k. That's including neutral. 3 hours, 56 minutes. That's all including neutral. So I, the laps was so the race was 167 k's 345 3 minutes 45 seconds so let's go back to this i had an average power of 302 a max of 1522 but that i did not get in the sprint i went and looked on garmin connect because i can see a bit more clear i got that actually following a move or out of a corner somewhere because it was quite early in the race. Um, max altered 194. So I think of the training that I've been doing, I'm not 
fresh because my heart rate normally goes almost 200, like 199, sometimes even over 200 if I'm really fresh. But that's not bad. 172, so permanently on the throttle. It was quite hard. Cadence 88, not bad, but considering it was a flat race, I expected more. Flat race being 1,500 meters of climbing. Average speed, you can say 44, because I've got the neutral in there. 44. And then an intensity factor up here of 0 0.89. So it was a very hard race for me. Um, some of my teammates told me back in the peloton it wasn't so hard all the time. But in the front it was quite hard. I think I made it hard for myself following moves, being part of the race. But that's my racing style. Definitely enjoyed this race. It was super fun. Enjoyed every second. Waiting for the next one and the next one and the next one. I just want to keep on improving a little bit or improving my bunch skills a bit or improving anything. Just if I improve a little aspect each race, I'm happy. So that race was definitely a success. So big thank you to the team for putting up with me at this race. The next one is this coming Saturday. Um, but I think it's a race that suits me a little bit less. So I'll be out helping and um, we'll smash it. So thank you very much to the team for accompanying me and looking after me in the race and just helping where they could. Next one, we'll go full gas. If you made it to this part of the video, thanks a lot for watching. Make sure to subscribe. Stay tuned for a new one. I don't have a schedule, but it will pop up when it does. So if you subscribe, hit the bell icon so that you know when my random videos pop up. And yeah, cheers. Guys. See you in the next one.